Hey, how's it going YouTube? So this is going to be a really quick guide on how to get all the hidden parts and all the combat logs in the game. I actually did replay through the entirety of the game just to make this guide and double check. So if this video helps you out, a like and a comment go a long way. So I'm going to be replaying through in order on the replay mission list. So first off, we have chapter one, destroy the transport helicopters. At the start of the mission, just destroy the first two helicopters. And after flying up here, you'll be behind these MTs. We'll clear them out first. Yeah, he's right there in the background. So all you gotta do is beat this guy and finish the mission. The next mission that has a hidden combat log is Chapter 1, Attack the Dam Complex. So this first mission, just destroy the MTs and the generators at the very start. So whenever we're destroying that, instead of following our friend over here, we're just going to fly over this wall to the right. And there's the MT we have to take out for the combat log. Watch out for these snipers up here. And now that he's dead, we still have to take out one more enemy. So over here where we have to destroy the last target by taking the jump pad up to it, we gotta kill this AC. And now that he's dead, just finish the mission. Now since we're doing this in order of the replay list, we have to actually do that mission again, the alternative version of that mission. So this mission is just like the last mission, uh, finish the first objective and then you'll have an offer to betray your sewing club brethren and uh, kill them. So we're going to do that. The next mission that has combat logs is Chapter 1 Operation Wall Climber. When the mission starts, just boost over the left side of the wall like I'm doing. And the three MTs you need to kill are right here. Now just finish the mission. The next mission with the combat log is Chapter 1's mission, Retrieve Combat Logs. All we gotta do at the start is drop down the giant pit. And right about over here we should be getting attacked by an AC. All we gotta do is take her out and beat the mission. The next mission that has a combat log is Chapter 1 Prisoner Rescue. Whenever you start the mission, just follow where I go. You want to make a left a little down the road. And right here is the MT you gotta take out for the combat log. Once he's destroyed, just finish the mission by helping the helicopter make it to its objectives. There is an AC at the end of this mission that you get a combat log for destroying, but I'm pretty sure you have to take him out so the helicopter doesn't get destroyed, so you'll find that easily. Confirmed. The chopper has exited the combat zone. The next mission is Chapter 2 Infiltrate Grid 086. There's four hidden parts and a bunch of combat logs on this one. Whenever the mission starts, just head towards the objective and eliminate the AC. Destroyed. 
Whenever he gets destroyed, just fly outside. And instead of making our way over to the objective, we're going to fly over behind us. And here's the two MTs we have to kill for their combat log. And once those two are destroyed, we're going to go on the opposite side of the building. And here we have to destroy these two droidicas for their combat log. Once that's done, we just need to make it to the objective. Now once we drop down here from the ceiling, instead of continuing onwards, we're going to turn around. And here's one of the wrecker parts. So instead of taking that door that progresses the mission, we're going to sneak right in here. This is probably the most hidden passageway in all of Armored Core 6. It took me forever to find this. But in here, there will be an AC that we have to eliminate, hiding right behind this wall. And also, here's the next hidden part. So on our way back out, we're going to make a right right outside of this hidden passage and drop down to the ground. And right behind us is the next hidden part. So back to the progression great gate, coming outside of the progression gate. We're going to overboost up to the top right. So almost as high up to the top right as we can get. And dropping down here is the last, yeah, right here, the last hidden part. To get the last data logs in this stage, we just need to drop down one more level from where the hidden part is and kill these MTs. This droidica and large MT. And now all you have to do is finish the mission. The next mission is Chapter 2, Stop the Secret Data Breach. There's multiple logs that we have to find. And right here in this starting room, we're just once again going to head through this hidden passage. And there should be a bunch of enemies in here we have to kill for the data logs. There is another MT here that you need to kill for a data log, but it's extremely hard to miss him. He'll be right here guarding the last two data, uh, data things. Chapter 2 Ocean Crossing has four combat logs that we need to find. So at the start of this mission, we're going to go underground to avoid the laser from firing. And right here, instead of continuing on uh, across the bridge to make it to the objective, we're going to drop down here to the right. And there should be... There they are. Two of these weird little flying alien things. Destroy them. And also there's two more back here at the end of the tunnel. So there's all those. And now just finish the mission. Next mission is Chapter 3, Steal the Survey Data. There's one MT we have to destroy for a combat log. At the start of the mission, just follow this road and it'll lead you directly to the MT. And you should be right here. So yeah, just take him out, finish the mission, and that'll be done. Chapter 3, Attack the Refueling Base is the next mission. There's two MTs we have to kill for their combat logs. At the start of the mission, just head towards the marker. So once you reach the objective, there's this MT here you gotta take out.
And once he's done, instead of crossing the bridge that's down here, you want to head to the right. This is one of the snipers you have to take out. The other sniper is on the other side of the bridge. And that's the last combat log on this mission. Just finish the mission and you have it. Next up is Chapter 3, Eliminate V7. There are two combat logs you need to find through this mission, and to get the last one, you actually have to replay the mission. So at the start, we just have to make it to the objective marker. I'm going to take this route that I normally use. If you're having issues with this mission, uh, just do what I do. So there's the objective over there, but if we look over here to the right, that's the MT we have to destroy. There's some uh, spotter MTs over here that you might want to take out first. Now that he's taken out, we just need to make it to the objective and finish the mission. So in order to get one of the data logs, we have to kill him, and the other one we have to accept his offer and fight a different AC that comes to take us out. There's your discipline right there, buddy. The next mission is Chapter 3, Tunnel Sabotage. There's a hidden part and also a combat log we have to get. So after the encounter with the few first few MTs, just follow me. You need to come up here to this bridge and make a left. And the sniper MT you have to kill is right there, and behind him is the hidden part. Now just finish the mission. Next, Chapter 3, Survey the Uninhabited Floating City. There's a hidden part and an MT you have to destroy for a combat log. So at the start of this mission, just follow the uh, little red markers to finish the first objective. And once you take over this uh, objective, you just need to go to the second red beacon. And then fly up this uh, oval building and the hidden part will be on top of it. For reference, there's the second objective right there. Once you make it to the third objective marker, where you have to get data from this destroyed MT, instead of collecting that, we're going to make a left. And there's this weird alien saucer we have to kill for the data. The combat data. So now that that's done, all you have to do is complete the mission. Next up is Chapter 3, Eliminate the Enforcement Squads. There's a combat log that you need to get. Right at the start of the mission, instead of proceeding, turn around and just follow where I go. Now that the AC is dead, all you have to do is finish the mission. Next, Chapter 3, Attack the Old Spaceport. You're going to find multiple combat logs in this mission. So at the start of this mission, for reference, uh, one of the MTs you have to take out is in that direction, right before the warships. And the other one is over here. The other two are over here. We're going to make a hard right, and we're going to fly over the bridge and get over to that second platform. There's the first one. So now that those are destroyed, there's only one more left.
Once he's dead, just finish the mission. So now chapter 3, Eliminate Honest Brute. This uh, mission has three hidden parts and tons of combat logs. To start off the mission, just follow me. So instead of following the original path and making it over there, we're just going to drop down here on this little side platform and the hidden part will be right here. The first combat log is right ahead of that part. You have to destroy this droidica. And next we're going to make it onto the platform that we went underneath and we have to kill this droidica if it ever wakes up. Next up is the hidden part that's on the end of this crane over here. And here's the second hidden part. Before you continue to the mission objective, don't forget to come back over here and kill this MT. It's got a combat log. And continuing on, the next MT we have to kill for a combat log is right in here in the middle of this energy shield. It's the Droidica. And the final part is once we drop down the first time, the chest is right here. And now just finish the mission and you're good to go. Next up is Chapter 4 Underground Exploration Depth 1. There's a hidden part we have to find. Once the partition closes, take out the enemies and then head towards the objective. Instead of hacking the objective, we're going to fly over it and the hidden part is right here. Now just finish the mission. Chapter 4 Underground Exploration Depth 2 has two hidden parts and some combat logs. When the mission begins, just get past the part where the AC tries to kill you. Once the AC is defeated, just follow the tunnel up until where the MT is sniping at you. Actually, you just want to keep following him all the way down until you can't follow him anymore. When the door closes behind him, just back off a little bit, and in this room there will be two MTs with combat logs and a hidden chest. Here's the hidden chest. To get the last hidden part, we have to backtrack. And once we take this jump pad up, there will be a hidden chest behind two of these, uh, I don't know, little welder drones, I guess. But yeah, now finish the mission, and you're good to go. Next up is Chapter 4 Underground Exploration Depth 3. There's two hidden parts and two combat logs. So instead of heading towards the core, we're going to hug this right wall in the beginning here. And right behind these canisters, or generators, we'll see the first hidden part. Continuing on towards the back of the core, this will be the first MT we have to take out for a combat log. And the next one is right over there. That's the last combat log you need. Whoops. And the part that you need is hidden right behind him. So now just finish the mission and you're good to go. Next up is Chapter 4 Unknown Territory Survey. There's a single hidden part and it's pretty hard to miss. At the start, just make your way through the cave. And instead of heading out that way towards the objective, we're just going to head back into the cave a few steps. It's right here, it's really hard to miss. And now that that's done, finish the mission. 
Next, we have Chapter 4, Reach the Coral Convergence. There's a hidden part in tons of combat logs we need to collect. Start the mission by taking out the two ACs. So once we're done with all that, we'll make our way to this bridge area. There's a swamp underneath. We're going to have to clear out all enemies, but for right now, let's just keep heading across the bridge. Once we reach the end, it'll spawn one of these bone wheel skeletons. And you have to make sure to come up here and kill this guy. He'll only spawn if you get to the top of the bridge, so don't forget about him. Towards the end of the broken down bridge, down here we can find the Moonlight Blade and make sure to kill all these enemies. So yeah, once all the enemies are defeated, don't forget about the Moonlight Blade right here. Oh, once I thought all the enemies were defeated. Trust me, you're going to be killing a lot of those guys down here in this swamp. So instead of heading up towards the objective, there's the bridge back there for context. We're going to make a right over here. And we're going to interact with this object. And this will get these two upgraded MTs to spawn. Make sure to stay on them as hard as you can, because whenever they start moving around, they become really tough to kill. And now that those two are dead, as long as, this, as long as the swamp has been fully cleared out, you just need to finish up this mission. Next up is the alternate Chapter 4 Reach the Coral Convergence mission. There's a hidden part, and if you're wondering, this is a New Game++ plus plus mission where you have to side with Allmind. To get the hidden part, right here at the start, all you have to do is follow me. The hidden part's right here on top of the building. Next is the mission Intercept the Corporate Forces in Chapter 5. There's a combat log you need to get that's pretty well hidden. So right at the start, we're going to overboost on top of this uh, glass ceiling, and that'll get the enemy to spawn. And once he's dead, as always, finish the mission. Next is the alternative mission to the one we just completed, Chapter 5 Eliminate Cinder Carla. There's only one combat log here, and it's super easy to uh, f figure out where to get it. But it is skippable, so I'm putting it in this video anyways. At the start of the mission, just head towards the objective. And once you make it to the first objective, you have to kill this AC. It is optional to kill him. I mean, it's pretty obvious he's right here. But yeah, make sure to take him out, then finish the mission. This next mission is Chapter 5 MIA. You need to get to New Game Plus Plus and side with Allmind in this playthrough to get this mission. All we need to do is get one combat log that's pretty easy to miss. At the start of the mission, just get as far as you can, since what we need is at towards the end of the mission. So at this point, you'll get uh, attacked from behind by three different enemies. Just take them out. Where we need to be is in the next room. So yeah, just open the next room and take out the enemies that are down the tunnel. Whatever you do, do not proceed to the next objective point. So after we've cleared out this room, we need to go right here. And we need to help rescue our buddy. I actually failed this my first time, so make sure that you're taking these guys out. Gun 13. Gun 13, right? Good work, Gun 13. You always did work hard for me. Handled all my requests. And yet. Watch out. And just like that, he betrays us and we have to take him out. And now just beat the mission. And the last and final mission is Chapter 5 Regain Control of Xylem. There's two hidden parts here and no combat logs. And by the way, this uh, is a mission you have to get to New Game Plus Plus and take the All Mind route to get. So right here at the very start, just drop down one level. And the hidden part is right here. Now we just need to destroy the next four objectives.
Once we destroyed those four objectives and you get into this room, just head straight and slightly right. And the last hidden part will be right here. And since this mission is so annoying, I'll just show you guys where the uh, next two objectives are you have to destroy. Oh, oh, there it is. And just finish the mission and that's fully done. And just like that, that's every single combat log and hidden part unlocked. So if this video helped you out, like and comment's always nice. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Hopefully I'll have something else for you guys. Peace out.